looks like we've got a, a guy in a gray shirt who might be interested. Yeah, heavy set male looking around. Yeah, and homeboy's walking over towards the car now slowly. No, he's right there. Looked into the passenger side. Looking around and started to walk south. black t-shirt with a younger female that's standing around it. There's an older female in a pink blouse leaning against a palm tree. Don't know if she's telling them to go away. Stand by. Yeah, I think they're one big happy family. Samaritans. All right, the family of three is now walking away southbound, so let's see what happens now. At this point, we've been there quite some time. Uh, you know, people are doing what they're supposed to be doing, you know, being good citizens, and uh, we said, let's pick up the bay car. All right, we're done here. Let's pick it up. Suddenly, that big happy family returns. Male uh, Hispanic, flat shirt over jeans. Oh, here we go. Walking over toward the driver's side. What appeared to be good Samaritans just started loading up into the car. Driver's door open, he stepped in. No, don't, don't put children in the car. No, don't put children in the car. Our minds go bonkers. We go, what the heck's going on? It turns from a good Samaritan, happy family, to an auto theft. They took the kid. Dude. No, you've got to be kidding me. This is terrible. To take that guy in jail just for endangering children. We could not believe that this girl was put in the car and she was screaming. It's going, it's going. He's standing at the driver's door. Go with me. Go. He stepped in. Go with me. Go with me. A man and woman have forced a young girl into a bait car. When I saw a little girl crying that she didn't want to get into the car. No, don't, don't put children in the car. I was angered by the situation. It's going, it's going. A crying kid in the car. <laughs> to take that guy in jail just for endangering children. It does change the dynamics when there's a child in there. Shutting the car down there at the spot would probably create greater dangers due to the amount of traffic in that major intersection. So we're going to follow it off to a safer area. It was to be advised, bait car is northbound on Avalon. That's northbound on Avalon. <laughs> She's laughing. That upset me. I was very, very upset, and I didn't like what I saw. Crushing a fresh screen at the next crush major. Oscar, don't make a mendigo cinturón. I guess if they forced a girl into a stolen car, we shouldn't be surprised by foul language. Looks like they're going to be making a right turn on T Street. The bait cars finally off the busy street. I have three black and white. Go ahead, take it, guys. If they weren't listening to the girl before, they are now. Okay, shut it down. 
Sí, ese es el carro que están buscando. ¿Sí? Sí. Tú me igual. Nosotros caímos. Hijo de Oscar. Oscar, cállate. Angélica, cállate. Might be a little late for that. Keep your hands up and stay calm. Manos arriba, this is the policía. Manos atrás. Put your hands in the back. Put your palms together for me. Alguien gana español, no más puede decir. Yeah, hate the ice. He'd better have a good explanation. ¿Por qué estás llorando? Porque nosotros no hicimos nada. El que nos dijo que es que está salvando. Yo nos dijo que llevábamos el carro. Ok. ¿Ese es tu carro? No, pero él nos dijo que lo llevábamos. Okay. Entonces, ¿por qué no tenía permiso de manejar ese carro, verdad? No, pero él nosotros no hicimos nada. Hey, hey, This is the way it is with bullies. Here he is, hard guy, tough guy with the kid. But then when somebody steps up and calls him on their behavior, you know, you're crying. <laughs> No, 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 no. After this little girl was brought out of the car, one of our uniformed officers pulled her to the side, talked to her. He also has kids too. That's what our job is, to be there for children, and that's exactly what he did. We learned that the young girl was actually the uh, younger sister to the driver, and the uh, passenger female was not her mother. Where were you guys going if the police weren't going to pull you over? Only to go where I need to go. Where did you need to go? To my job. Okay, now the little girl, she was crying when you went to go put her in the car. She didn't want to go. I know. Why was she crying? I was crying. She even knew not. She didn't want to get in the car, huh? Yeah, yeah. She knew it was wrong to get in the car, huh? Yeah. And so did you, right? And so did your boyfriend, right? After the deputies and officers had talked to this little girl to make sure she was fine, I still personally wanted to make sure she was okay and make sure, number one, that she was in her heart safe. Where's your mom right now? She's in Mexico. She visiting family in Mexico? How about, is your grandma there? No. no? Okay. I have to drop her off in uh, Inglewood to answer. Okay. Us. The girl was amazing. She was a little sweetheart. She was something. Thank you for being good. You're awesome. There are child endangerment issues here. We will present the evidence. That's up to the judges and the district attorney's office. When I go home, we don't talk about police work. However, after this incident, I went home and I told my family and friends about it. And everyone, out of all the bait cart incidents we've had, this one stood out the most because a little child was involved.